deep breath in. Oh, there it goes. And out. Next one. Need a break? No, I'm good. Okay. And out. We'll do the same thing. Boom. All right, feel free to adjust it as necessary. So what brings you in then? Just overall maintenance, you know, always tight from working out for uh, 15 years. Okay. So I told you I've had the lower lower back issue, but it's pretty good now. I'm mostly upper back. I've had some lat tightness in my lats. And okay. Traps are always tight. Okay. Well, I mean, you're really, your upper traps are really developed. No radiating symptoms into mm -hmm. your arms? No. Nothing like that? Yeah. Okay. I mean, he's been adjusted since he was a kid. So. Is it like me? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. His pastor, or no. My dad was. Your a dad pastor. was a pastor, and the chiropractor adjusted him yeah. all the time. So he's, and you've been going to chiropractors, you said, pretty mm -hmm. consistently your whole life. Yeah. Okay. This is a little intimidating, you know, for somebody my size. <laughs> I'm just like, okay, let's help. Okay. Do a lot of stretching. So okay, should be, okay. Should be, yeah. Um, so it's just mostly your low back. Does it hurt right now? No, no, I'm, good. I'm just tight every okay? day. I stretch every day, but so I'm just. So you just want to once over? Yeah, I'm always tight. All right. It feels like my more my right side, like on the back of my neck. On the neck. Because I sleep on one side. Yeah, I can see that here. Yeah. Right here. So Diego, come on back here with the camera. Because we, yeah, you see how this is pulling here, compared to the side how this is sunken in. And then, like from here at the base of his skull, it's all spasmed all the way down to here. Okay, and then what we have, we have this over here, spasm, kind of disappears right here, and then switches sides and goes to this side. Do you mind if I lift up the shirt? Sure. Just gonna check. Oh, still looks pretty even though. Pretty good. Yeah, when I'm. Slight difference. When I had that two years ago, I was like tilted a little bit oh, to that absolutely. side. Oh, absolutely. Antalgic lean. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So it took a long time to retrain my core and get mm -hmm. things strong. I could really find where I was weak. You do kind of walk on your, the tip, like up on your toes. Yeah, my whole life. Whole life. Okay. My son does too. Yeah. Okay. You know, just notice. I kind of see that this is coming forward, but not as much as you think. Okay. I really see this winged out, and that's yeah. more of the ilium kind of going like that does that make sense the whole pelvis is yeah. going yeah like that and yeah sure it's going to feel like it pulls here in the front mm -hmm. but it's not really what you think you know you can stretch it and stretch it and stretch it that's not going to fix it that's what you do also going forward makes things worse going backwards makes things better straightens things out yeah. because this just by default straightens out pelvic curb curvatures everything okay. so I can pop it right this is going to go back you yeah. know stre now stretching people think okay I'm tight here I'm going to stretch it back this way you have to be careful you have to be careful because if the bones aren't moving which sounds like you get adjusted enough mm -hmm. you can tear you yeah can tear. I, I have guys tear hip flexors all the time yeah and then it's like so just be careful yeah that's all I'm saying am I in the center can you see the top of my head Mm -hmm. <laughs> he's like, more in the center. He's more in the center. That's good. <laughs> okay. Oh, this is gonna be a lot of work. Do you, you probably don't even feel that? I don't react to really. <laughs> it. It's funny. I mean, I'm massage. Like, like, like I go. I was like, go as hard as you can. I like torture. They're like, is this hurt? I'm like, oh, you just gotta pay him more. <laughs> Whenever somebody's like, go as hard as you can, I'm like, if you want me to break my body for you, I need more money. It's going to cost extra. It's going to cost extra. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, it's definitely, you're definitely getting in there. Yeah, it's there. I don't have any leverage here, though. I have no leverage. It's just a warm up. Now, what happens is, is what you run a risk of for having these traps up here so developed is that there's a big plexus that goes down into your arm. Mm -hmm. So you always be careful of that, and you'll be fine. Understand that when you do this, you pinch it. When you lift this up, you pinch it. So that's that, why when I sleep on that side, it jacks it up. Yeah. You, you don't sleep with this. Yeah, don't sleep, sleep with it. No, you, yeah, even doing yeah. that is going to close that hole. Okay, and you're more prone to it because you have this big piece of muscle here over top of it. Now, it's great for getting hit. 
Mm-hmm. Okay, it's great for impact. You can yeah. handle a lot of things falling axe, on top axe of you. Axe kick won't work. Yeah, axe kick won't work. <laughs> Your collarbone won't, you know, break. Yeah, there's no shutting down in my clavicle. Sorry, that won't work. <laughs> <laughs> but um, you're going to be fighting it trying to crimp that, that big yeah. plexus of nerves that runs in here, okay? That's your first rib right there. Very first one that you have. It's all the way up here. Wow. Okay, it saves you from, here we go again, things falling on you and your lungs being punctured. Mm. Okay? Yeah. It's good a good thing that. to have. But the nerves go right there, okay? <laughs> and when you sleep with your arm up, you're pinching that hole. <laughs> Scoot up for me up here. Here, here. here we go. Relax here. There's one. Yeah, right here. What's oh, got on that side? Oh my goodness. Right here, relax. There you go. Woo! There you go. <laughs> I'm just staring through these. Are you all right? It feels great. Yeah, it's doing pretty good. I can tell you've been worked on. Yeah, I've had dry needling on the trap before to finally release it. Yeah. And it, it took a while, but it worked. <laughs> if I zap you, it's yeah. enough. Yeah. <laughs> like, okay, okay, how long okay, okay. Start okay. cooking it. <laughs> What, what do you want? Hot oil or the rag? <laughs> Take your pick. Try needling or thumb in there. <laughs> oh, other side. Very good. The rest of that trap, I mean, I've been working on it for like 10 minutes. That left trap. It's going to take some body weight there on my part. The only place that I don't think anybody's been is up here in this upper region. Yeah, if they have, it's been a long time. Yeah, it, that's the only thing that, like, I'm like, oh, that, that's stuck. It's kind of glued up there. <laughs> you know, I mean, it moved. Just, I was like, oh, for somebody that's been adjusted their whole life, I felt like it should have moved a little more. Right there, that one. Mm. Okay. The lower neck feels great. So that's saving you from this arm pain and... Mm-hmm. smaller joints than in the neck. You know, a little easier. Yeah. My ankle. A little bit of flat feet, huh? Yeah, super flat. Yeah. So like, ah, oh, just a little bit, right? But you guys stay instead. And they always try to have you wear the orthotics, but they always look back. As long, as long as, I mean, if it gives you relief, that's fine. No, I made it worse. But I, I've never been successful with it, so. Just, I'm like, you were made that way for a reason. Like, oh, no. See how it just doesn't. A little bit there. Yeah, a little bit. It's just not giving me. I'm getting it in pieces. <laughs> you mind having your shirt off? Sure. It sticks? What do you mean? it? Like when I do pull downs, like I feel like it's like. What do you feel? Like it's like. I don't know, like some stuck. And I was actually working out with like, a, a pro body there one time, and he like pulled it at the top of the movement, and it, and it like unpopped it, and it felt good. Okay. But like, okay. it gets stuck. Like I don't know if it's an adhesion in there. Or... Maybe I'll, I'll find out. It might be something you have to constantly check up on. Now scoot yourself up a little bit for me, so your face doesn't hit that wood piece in there. Okay. Mm-hmm. All right, let me see how this moves. Take a deep breath in. All the way out for me. Pretty good. I haven't worked on it. You know, I haven't warmed it up. Right. I'm just seeing what it, what it wants to do. Deep breath in again. Oh man, I just bounced right off of you. 
<laughs> Take a deep breath in again. That's all I got. You don't need the foot. You okay with this? Mm hmm. Breathe for me. Are our hands on the ground for me on the carpet? Oh, wow. Okay. Take a deep breath in. And out. I mean, my roller's flattening. <laughs> That's how much pressure I'm like bending the roller. <laughs> what view? Oh, go get your chunkless then. That cap is crazy. Oh, sorry. It's almost done. This this is a smaller region that I can work on. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I got enough power for this one. And here's the bad one. Take a deep breath in. And five, four, three, two, and one. Yep, here we go again. Gonna drag it down. Arm over your head for me. Doing okay? Yep. I want it round so that it doesn't hurt you. Doesn't cut your skin. Yeah. Just the tissue, just moving that tissue around. That's it, now the same thing, arm over your head again. Yeah, let's get into that lat. Let me see what I find. My little hand can't do that. Yeah. <laughs> you know, this can. You tore right through it. <laughs> How did you do that? <laughs> Tools. <laughs> I use my hand to check, just to feel, make sure I'm doing okay. Then I come back. Here we go. Whoosh. 
I know, I know. Yeah, right in that corner. Yeah. There it comes. There, that's it. Is it tied into like, the tricep at all? Uh, yeah, absolutely. Oh, yeah. Any of these. I just have to be careful. Your vein is right there. I don't need broken blood vessels. <laughs> I can see your vein there. So I keep checking it. I don't, you know, I don't want to burst that. Perfect. Okay. That's the back side of it. We got to still do the front. Relax this down, lower the back down. Come on, come on. That's it. Let me in. That's it. Breathe. Hold your breath. Good. Now I'm just breathing for me. <laughs> <laughs> this arm behind your back for me. Gonna release the scapula, okay? Excellent. Good. The same thing. Here we go. Perfect. Good. It's getting there. <laughs> it's getting there. Nope. You guys are doing pretty good <laughs> with the low oh. back. Glutes. I'm going to go right here on your glute, okay, with my elbow. Yep. Feels good. Yeah. There's no um, real scars. I'm going to go down to the ischial tuberosity, which is down here, okay? Okay. I feel like I need to use more body weight though. Like I'm wondering how much you can take. You have, you probably could take a lot more. I don't like, know, that right calf, you got me pretty good. I was Okay, I can avoid that one. No, that no, one's probably no, pretty no, good. No. But like no. I almost need to like walk on you on these, you know? I'm just not getting anywhere. This one needs a little more work. I'll do that one. Yeah. I'd rather do it at least with my hands and my you know, than my feet for yeah. last. Yeah. I don't know you yet. Here we go. Oil, more oil. Oh, wow. Hmm. over here too.
lift this arm up again for me, like just over your head. I'm getting underneath there for you. Arm down, good. Same thing I'll ask you to do with this one. And relax, relax that, that's it. I usually don't mind you guys fighting me, but on that one I can't, I simply can't get yeah. under there. <laughs> and then relax. Good. All right. So, you can come on up, watch the mic on your left. know how much I'm going to be able to get to the top, but we can try. Hands on your hips. We're going to do the same thing. Sit up as straight as you can for me. Then your elbow back into the wall. Yeah. And again. No, you're probably the pop one that popped earlier. Oh, that's why. Yeah. You're right. I'm like, uh, my shoulder's going to dislocate before yours. <laughs> <laughs> At this point. Lean away. You're right. Popping a joint that has nothing left. Yeah, that, that's why. <laughs> Hands on your hips. Sit up as straight as you can for me. And then just elbow back. Yep. Okay. There you go. <laughs> Ooh, oh, you're both of your elbows. You need to work on extension. Lean away. But they were sitting slightly out of socket. Mm. And that's, you don't want them to... Those sound good. That, that'll, just make sure you stretch the front part of your arms. Mm -hmm. Stretch so you can lay on the floor on your stomach. Something as easy as just laying on your floor and put me. Put, I'll show you in a second. <laughs> For me to get these next set, okay? Because you need a lot of work on the front. But I don't know. That, that's that hot. For your height, you know, it sounds relatively thin. There it goes, a little bit. An armpit, okay? Got it. Yeah, you need somebody to open up this, these, these shoulders. Mm -hmm. your, your arm, you know, open that up for you. Constantly. It's just the way it is. You could probably get like a baseball and do it yourself. Yeah, I have a softball and lacrosse ball at home. Yeah, just kind of. Drink a lot of water after this. Quite a bit came out on your back. All right. So it makes you feel ill if you don't uh, have it done. If you don't um, drink water, Epsom salt bath if you want. Oh. I do drink two and a half to three gallons a day. Yeah, I was gonna say I probably don't have to tell somebody like you that, but you know, for legality, I just say it. Yeah. It's All amazing right. how much how little people drink water. Water, water, water. Well, when you have all that cellular respiration going on, you need to flush. Mm -hmm. So if they're sitting, they don't really 
require as much as you think. But a person like you that's working out to that level five times a week, yeah, you need to drink a lot. You have a lot of body mass. Somebody like me doesn't need to drink as much. You know? But somebody your size, yeah, definitely they need to be. You know, it just takes that much more energy to consume because mm -hmm. you still only have one mouth, one right. gut. Right. You know what I mean? Like, yeah, it's sometimes it's like putting it in a blender and just chugging it to get it in, into yeah. you, you know? It's like, yeah, when I was younger, that's what I did. Raw eggs and protein just, yeah, and just peanut butter. Any way you can. Anything get it I could do. So the trick with this is, is that there's a lot of fascia and people don't realize that so if you're on the, su on the superficial surface, you're on the fascia. Mm -hmm. So you gotta go find the muscle and it's underneath that fascia, <laughs> right up into here, into that attachment. Okay. I don't wanna pull off of the attachment. Push towards it. Push towards it. Okay. I see people doing all kinds of weird stuff and I'm like, yeah. no, 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 push onto that attachment. Just hold it down. They get lifted up every time you do a squat, every time you do a, yeah. a kick of some sort, they're going to come off of that attachment. You tear it. That's how your muscles grow. But right. every once in a while, you just want to push that back down mm -hmm. onto that. Yeah, it feels good. It comes right here on that bone. Just push it back down onto it. So people try to stretch. And like I was, I was like, he's not going to understand until I actually do it. <laughs> but if you stretch this, you're stretching that middle portion. Mm. So it's fine. It's just you're going to be tearing it off of the attachment. So you're so you, not, you're not, you're not kind of, you're not, you don't want to push these back down. You don't want to tear them off by stretching. Because okay. the one thing that's very common in here is I did a stretch and I heard a pop. Yeah. And I'm like. Yeah, you did it wrong. A head goes back for me. Wish me luck. <laughs> I'm kidding. It's just what you want doctors to say. even just hold that pretty good all right here we go that's everything I got right there stay right there oh let me show you how to do the, this hip here okay same thing I'm sorry I'm gonna be like on top of you Feel that one? Mm -hmm. That's where it tears, right there. Hold. Excellent. Yeah, she wanted to come see. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Just a little bit of abuse. Oh, it's, he's almost ready. <laughs> All right, um, so shirt back on. Or do you want to take a picture of this back? What? It's a lot of fatigue. <laughs> oh wow. Okay. Yeah, it feels amazing. <laughs> Tap out if you want me to stop, but mm -hmm. I don't think you're gonna feel it. Your sacrum. <laughs> oh, that one 
again? <laughs> You're not real poppy clicky either. It just vibrates. Is that good or bad? It's just you. It's probably good for all the muscle that you have. My husband doesn't pop that much either. It kind of like <laughs> grinds in the place like, <laughs> yeah. you know. I can feel it vibrate. That's all that counts. There's another one. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, give me a break. Ooh. Need more paper love? Yeah, I got it. Oh, hi. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna adjust the top ribs, okay? Mm -hmm. All right, I got it done. That's all I got. Try to get not off of your scapula, you know, just your bone. It's not here, just walk on that forever. All right, take a break. You okay? Yeah. He's is sore on this calf here. Yeah. This is how this is what they do. They get a bar. They're in there just working on them. I already went through with the with the roller with my whole body yeah. on them. So you know. Oh just Ooh. like that. That hamstring, I've torn that a couple times. Uh oh. <laughs> no, you, no, you're good. I mean, I'm not on any place where I would tear no, it, but I, still, I kind of like push. I thought I was able to get back in shape. I sprinted once and pop. Yep, just kind of like, you know, you can do all that stuff on them, but. I asked her to, but she just doesn't. It's a lot of work. <laughs> yeah. You got to pay her. <laughs> married you <laughs> <laughs> yeah that's everything right there it's all it goes like a hit end you know all right come on up and see how it feels see if i missed anything just want to stand up for me let me just check your posture really quickly that's way back now <laughs> you're what? like you know your hip this old pelvis all right, take a, take a walk for me. I'm just gonna see if I see anything else. No, it looks fine. How you feeling, okay? Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, I had some And then you're gonna lean back over it. You're not gonna roll. Bend your knees. Roll it down until your head touches the ground. No, other way. Right to there, bird. Yeah, I see that. Lean your way. Lean. Good. Nope. That's all I did. Put Good. Her. Good. That's all. You know, if you had an adhesion, it mm -hmm. would make a sound. Like, if you notice, all of them, only one part of her ear popped. That's weird. On that one side. Yeah, if you have, like, your, if your ear is stuck to your skull, it'll, as it comes mm -hmm. off. 